Okay, um, I know it's kind of a mess, but this is what I got today. This is actually the last video I'm doing, but I'm going to put it in first order. I think I said I spent $242, yeah, on everything I spent today. Um, I got a lot of stuff, so I'm happy, and a lot of stuff was cheap, and I actually found some games. I'll start with the last thing I bought. I bought a Nintendo 64 with an expansion. It was $35. It had the power supply, and it has an aftermarket controller, and I got these two games for it. Perfect Dark and uh, Disney Aladdin. I'm probably going to try and get, at the very least, 50 for this, and if I can't get it, I don't care. I'll just save it for a show. I'd like to get 60, you know, and then Perfect Dark. I don't know. It's probably a seven or eight dollar game. And Disney's Aladdin in the case. I might take it to a show because it has a cover. I don't know. Um, so that was the last thing I bought. Um, let's see. Oh, I bought a Wii. Let's see. Let me just get this out of the way. Okay, I bought a Wii, and it looks complete. It has several controllers. And it has uh, Super Mario Brothers. Uh, and then I bought this at a different sale. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pair these up. And I'm going to sell the Wii as a GameCube player and, and a Wii. I think I paid $20 and I paid a dollar for the controller. So, But this way, I can't sell Wiis. But if it's a GameCube player, because once you have the controller, you can sell it for that. And then I can, I think I could probably get maybe 45 for it. I don't know. Um, here's some random games. I got St. Rose, uh, Ben 10 for PS2, Star Wars episode. I got a feeling I paid a buck for these. What's this? I do that last. Um, you know what? I'll save that. Okay. Here's some more Lego battles. I think I paid two bucks. Pirates of Caribbean, two bucks. That's an empty bag. Uh, what's in here? I didn't do that yet. I didn't do that. Okay. Um, Tinkerbell. I think I paid two bucks. Maybe three for five. Um, paid three dollars, two for five for this. Defiance, The Walking Dead, Dead Island, Call of Duty Ghost. But I got this. A Super Nintendo Family Feud. Uh, I believe it's complete in the box. Uh, not that it's very valuable, but it's kind of nice to find a complete box game. Wheel of Fortune, Super Nintendo. And I only paid a buck a piece for them, uh, which was great. You know, they're probably only worth eight dollars, but whatever. Eight times my money. I wish I could do that all day. Uh, this was a dollar. This was fifty cents. Resident Evil. This was a dollar. With that, and these were fifty cents a piece. Loose disc, Red Dead Redemption, and this. This is a Sonic Ultimate Genesis Collect Genesis Collection, uh, or the. Uh, Xbox 360. Here's a Wiimote. I mean a nunchuck. Oh, and here. This is one of the better old school things I bought today. Super Game Boy. I paid a dollar? Or I think I, think I paid a dollar for that. Alright, let's see. What's this? Do that last. Okay, I already did this. I did all these. Uh, okay, this bag has little stuff in it. So I'm just going to show it. Um, this is sealed. So I don't know if that's a big deal, but Super Scribble Knots. And then these were, they had a buck fifty a piece on them. So I said, hey, will you take a dollar piece? Cake Mania, Nintendogs. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? These are really low value games. Pet Shop, um, Style, La Jewelry Design. I'm going to just, I think I'm going to put these on eBay as a lot. Hamsters. I don't know, I'll take them out for a little while. I'll see what happens. Cookie Mama 3, the Legendary Starfy. Starfy. Um, Smackdown versus Raw. I don't know. I, like I said, a buck a piece I paid for these. Um, and included the sealed one. My Fashion Mall. They're, they're just girl games. Gardening, gardening Mama. Cooking Mama. Zuzu Pets. Big Brain. M&M's. Littlest pet shop. All right, so that's that. All right, uh, more stuff over here. This is an Edge Decade of Decadence. Resident Evil, it's missing a disc. Can't remember what I paid for this. Sonic the Secret Rings, maybe two bucks. 
Batman the video game, probably two bucks. Uh, oh, wait, wait, did I already? No, I didn't go there. Okay, this is something I wanted to save. Sonic DX. I can't, I can't remember what I paid for it. Um, Bakukan, I think I paid two bucks. Bakukan Battle Brawlers. And this, one of these, this one has two games in it. One of these has... This one has two games in it. Silent Hill 2. I think I made three dollars. Two for five on these. Because uh, I got the GameCube at the same place. Destroy All Humans 2. I don't know if... I think I paid three dollars. Road Rage Simpson. I think I paid three dollars. Uh, two for five. Okay. Um, the last bag. This is it. Tomorrow, I am going to be in... I'm going to be at the Saddlebrook Street Fair. Twenty bucks. I got a uh, Game Boy Advance... It doesn't power on, but the guy said it was his kid. It works, right? Uh, it's in relatively good condition, cosmetic condition. A little scuffed up in the front. Came with Mario Kart Super Circuit. I got the charger. Actually, I got two chargers. Because one of the chargers is for an original uh, fat uh, Nintendo DS. The screen needs a little cleaning. It's a little scuffed up. Um, but And it, also, it doesn't come on, but... The coolest thing about this one is I got one of these uh, R4 um, Revolution for DS discs. Uh, this should have a bunch of games on it. It should be loaded with games. Uh, I love finding these because it just means I have a game library I can carry around. And uh, I don't think I can sell them. I don't know if I could, but I, I don't think I'd try and sell them. Anyway. anyway, that's it. That's everything I got today. Well, I, except you're going to see everything after this. I'm going to be in Saddlebrook tomorrow at the street fair. I'll be bringing games, CDs, DVDs, jewelry, and maybe a little bit of miscellaneous stuff. But uh, if you want to find me, that's where I'll be tomorrow. Today's Saturday, and I went to the Kenilworth uh, Townwide, and I found a lot of stuff today. Um, basically $242 worth of stuff. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go through this stuff. And I got a mix of everything. Games, CDs. Uh, things like that. Uh, let me see. And I think I'm going to sort it as I go through. Stuff that I'll take out immediately tomorrow. Uh, most of the CDs I got today was like... Uh, okay, this, this, these two bags of CDs that I got today, um, they were um, 20 bucks. The guy was like... The guy had sold some of his CDs and... Uh, he said, yeah, the rest are $20. Now, this bag is all stuff that's either missing or scuffed up or whatever. I sorted them while I was in the car, right? Um, and so for 20 bucks, basically what's in this bag is what I got. And uh, it's, not, it's not bad stuff. Definitely, like, uh, the stuff that I'm putting in here is stuff that I'm not going to take out tomorrow. I'm going to deal with it another day. But I got stuff I can definitely put, like, 5 bucks on. And then stuff that I just don't want to deal with. So I'm just going to go through it. Yanni, Drummond, Julian Hatfield, Urban Groove. Um, stuff like this, I might take out at some point and just try and sell it for a dollar. And then Iglesias, Sade. Let me do Sade. Let's do this. I'm really kind of pressed for time today, and I have to worry about the weather. Candle box. Uh, turn it on me. Mother love bone. So, I might edit this together into a different order. Because this is the first video I'm doing. Like, to show the games first. Because I just grabbed whatever I, I could. Let's see. Who's this? Dio. Let me check that guy. Uh, Indian Summer. You know, Diamond Jazz Singer, Toadies. Yeah, the ones I'm putting to the side now are just is just the stuff I'm going to take out tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm doing the uh, Saddlebrook Street Fair. Surf, Smash Mouth, uh, Michael Bublé. Who's this? Super Sally. Let's see. Maroon 5, Green Day. Paul Mitchell, I don't know. That one's sealed. Journey, Generation, Simon and Garfunkel, Smash Mouth. Yeah, so basically, I'm just going to go through everything. No particular order, just very random. Chicago. 
Chicago Christmas. I'm going to start taking out Christmas stuff. Because uh, we're getting there. The Verve Pipe. What's this? Europe. Tunnel Hits. It's greatest hits, Thunderbirds. Fabulous Thunderbirds. Three Amigos. Beautiful Mine. Last Man Standing. Gladiator. Joe Pesci. I'll give that to a friend of mine. He's a friend of the Pesh. Salt and Pepper, Offspring, uh, October Project. The other stuff that I'm not taking, putting on the floor, is stuff I'll take out eventually at uh, another point. Okay, uh, here's more CDs. Like I said, most of the CDs I spent anywhere from... I'm like listening. I, it almost sounded like it was going to start raining. Because it could start raining at any point. Sly and Family Stone. Poison, Joe Cocker, Fabulous Thunderbird, Bruce Springsteen, Atlanta Rhythm Section. This is stuff I'm going to put for $5. James Brown, Santana, $4. Oh, here's a game I got. Tinkerbell. I got these two uh, Blu-rays. Cars, move like this. Scandal, Squeeze Singles. Yeah, I've been into selling CDs lately. The Imperial, mostly because I'm not finding that many games. But today I did find some games, like the mechanics. I think going to that town wide was a good idea. Footloose, Jimi Hendrix. Oh, and this is a seal cassette. All right, let me just grab another bag. Uh, I'll get to this stuff later. There's a box. Let me put this as games. Let me put this game with the other games. All right. This is a puzzle box. It's shaped like a fish. All right. Um, there's a bag that's going to blow away. All right. I think I'm going to do this box, and then I'll and then I'll edit the videos together. Uh, Fred Astaire, John Denver collection, River Dance, Inspirational Songbook, Meat Loaf, Bon Jovi. I'm in Jersey Christmas with Elvis, Jim Croce, Sealed. Uh, automotive. Oh, uh, who is that? It's Aerosmith. Uh, that's a game. I'll do that later. Another game. Uh, another Blu-ray. Uh, Jack and the Giant. This is uh, America Tribute to Heroes. It's a sorted artist, Ozzy Osbourne. Barbara Streisand. B.B. King. Tina Turner. Sealed in excess kick. Cinderella. It's like a 90s uh, rock band. Eddie Money. Super Hits. Elton John, Bon Jovi, Whitesnake, Aerosmith, Maroon 5, Britney Spears, Grease, The Best of R.E.M., Skid Row, uh, Guns N' Roses, Appetite for Destruction, Velvet Revolver, oh, Jesus, hold on. Uh, that? Tony Bennett, Duets 2, Crosby, Stills & Nash. Uh, Elvis Costello and the Attraction, Attractions, R.E.M., Police, Depeche Mode, Nirvana, Best of Prince, Honey Kravitz Greatest Hits, Nas, Nas, uh, Billy Joel Greatest Hits. Here's a game, I'll do that later. So anyway, like I'm saying, most of the CDs I bought today were 50 Cent, Daryl Hall, John Oates, Bruce Springsteen, Bay City Rollers, Power of Gospel, Alice Cooper, Fine Young Cannibals. White Lion, uh, the best of Eric Carmen. Don't, uh, I'm not sure who he is. He's got a number three on a Bruce Springsteen uh, anthology. Karaoke, Big and Rich. Who's that? Notorious. Wait a minute. I don't know why I took that one. All right. Uh, Billy Joel, Asia, and Tears for Fear. Songs from the Big Chair. Okay, I'll, I'll go through this stuff in the next video. I'll do it all together. It, this bag, I think, has mostly records and DVD sets. Like, here's a Seinfeld Season 1 and 2 that I got for $2. Um, here's a Hero Season 3. I bought it for my friend. Uh, let's see. Okay, games I'll just do to the side. Uh, what's this? Uh, Star Trek. Uh, this I want. Yeah, this is like... Uh, Batman's Prometheus 
Nah, I'll sell it. I already seen it. Uh, Book of Eli. I want to see that again. Actually, nah, I'll sell Prometheus. Uh, I got a Walking Dead that I'm going to take inside. It's for my kid. She wants to read it. It says number one, but, you know, I'm not sure it's not the real number one. Real number one's worth like a thousand bucks. I Am Legend Blu-ray. Oh, actually, let me take that inside for now. Here's a Blondie. I paid $3 for this. It's like a CD set. I want to put it on my iPod, then I'll get my money back. Maybe make a few dollars. Uh, Tony Bennett, 16 most requested. Hero Season 3 I already showed. Okay. Let's see what else is in this bag. Games I'll, I'll do all together when I'm ready. Uh, game. Games, okay. This. A Hobbit. Destruction of Smog. Smog. Uh, these all look like games. Okay. Oh, and then I also got some records. Let's see what else is in here. Anything? Close there for a second. These were two bucks a piece. I don't always buy records, but these looks pretty clean. Um, Led Zeppelin, Bob Dylan, Jethro Tull, Rolling Stone, Some Girls, uh, Pink Floyd, The Wall, and a Steppenwolf second, a kind of a shiny cover. All right, next I'll do uh, random stuff, and then I'll uh, maybe next I'll do games, and then I'll do jewelry. I'm gonna, like I said, piece everything together at, at, this, at the end of the video. Okay, now I'm going to do some random action figures I got. Um, these were 50 cents a piece. Uh, these cars. And uh, they're just Spider-Man cars. Mostly. I don't know what that one is. There might be other super villains. That looks like Spider-Man. Yep. Motorcycles. And um, then this stuff. The regular action figures were a quarter a piece. So I was scooping these up. This is from Ben 10. It's a big one. I don't know who that is. Looks like somebody Transformers, but here's a random sp uh, Spider-Man uh, bug guy. This looks like a Pokemon type thing, but I'll figure it out later. Uh, Transformer, Power Ranger, possibly a Pokemon. Uh, Power Ranger, Spider-Man. I think he goes on one of the motorcycles. Doc Octopus, um, Small Power Ranger, S Captain America, Flash, Power Ranger, Power Ranger, a Spider Man Motorcycle, uh, Spider Man, and this is a game. I'll put it with the other games. I'll do that later. Oh, one more. Batman. Okay, um, for $2 at a sale, where I also got some other cheap stuff, including. Um, Rip to the Ruthless, and this is uh, Undertaker. All right, let's see. Oh, I got these for five dollars. These are plastic Transformer sculptures. Um, that one. I'm gonna start taking stuff like this to the game conventions. I'm doing another com game convention, and here's another one. And this is uh, what's his name? The one that only talks with the radio. All right. Okay. That's jewelry. Empty, empty, empty. I got this, Spider-Man. I'm sorry, it's a Gotham City Jail. And then I got more figures in here. I'll just dump these out and then I'll put everything in this bag. This looks like a Spider-Man. I bought this at a different sale, but he might ride, uh, sit on one of the motorcycles. Uh, Superman with blowing action. I don't know what the hell he does. Um, Power Ranger. Yo Dirty Yoshi. Uh, wrestler Dude. Uh, Spider-Man. Turtle. He seems to make noise. Uh, here's another turtle. Here's a wrestler. This stuff, again, I think it was like a quarter a piece. Uh, Despicable Me. Batman. Wrestler. Wrestler, Wrestler, Lex Luthor, Punisher, Wrestler, Ninja Turtle, Joker, these were quarter, Joker, Spider-Man, Flash, and then there's some uh, Minecraft things, again I'll go through these later, and a Spider-Man, some of the Spider-Man, uh, Batman, like that Minecraft dude, and then there's a couple of random games in here. Right, throw those over there. Uh, they go with this stuff. Um, let me see, any more action figures? 
Okay. Uh, I'll do, I'll do, now I'm going to pack again. I'll do another video, I piece it all together. Okay, um, I'm going to do jewelry and random stuff. I know my wife paid 20 bucks for this. Uh, this is all silver and stone bead. This one's like a liquid silver and multi-stone and shell. This is like a turquoise, turquoise looking uh, amethyst, uh, garnet. And again, just multi-stone, some, some uh, beads there. I mean, they're kind of tiny. Like my like I think she paid five for the two of these. Um, this says like probably faux pearl sterling and uh, that. This is a, she paid a dollar for that ring and then I guess she paid a dollar for this crystal set. And uh, it came with matching earrings. I don't remember what she paid for this. Uh, this is uh, a lucite and I don't know, it looks like coral, you know, some, something like that. These are glass black beads. This is a fossil watch. And, uh, okay, that's all the jewelry she got today. She didn't get hardly any jewelry. Um, this is for my friend who likes to list this stuff. This is a nativity set. It's, and this one has German nativity figures. So this is a nice old one, made in Western Germany. Uh, that would date it from be uh, before the 80s. There's a bunch of figures in here. I don't really have time to go through them all right now. My friend's getting this, so it really doesn't matter. And here, here's a SpongeBob lamp. I paid a dollar for it. It needs a screw over here. Needs a screw. Um, but whatever. That I'm going to take to the toy show. Uh, this is a glass lamp. I I'm sorry, glass vase. I didn't notice it has that... that uh, calcium on the inside but this this is nice it's iridized polished bottom it could be like I don't know maybe a Dugan type or something like that here is a blue coat got for a dollar okay that's random stuff um, the first video I'm gonna do which will be uh, actually it's the last video I'm doing now but it'll be games